because I'm sitting here reflecting on how us women, female gods, goddesses, empress, have so much power inside and because of this we have so much responsibility placed on us the physical part of us the mental side of us and as we grow um, spiritual did I say spiritual and it's so important but yet so hard um or so necessary because anything important is not going to be easy but necessary that we stay strong and composed um, so that we can continue to grow and when we are composed and balanced in our thoughts our minds we can really be more powerful than we really are or more powerful than we know ourselves to be and in doing so opens up portals of abilities to heal to teach to guide and to protect the persons around us our children our grandchildren, our nieces and our nephews. And when we're balanced as female energies, the world is balanced. So when you look around and you see a lot of chaos, um, either outside of your window or right inside of your home, that chaotic energy is a female energy. That's a that's a, f a female energy that is imbalanced, and whoever is in close prox prox what's that word proximity um will feel that energy. So if you're in imbalanced, if you're like like wild those persons around you are going to feel that energy and if you're calm then that energy is also going to be felt so I came here to say right now is the time with this energy of the eclipse retrogrades that are going on this energy of war, this new season that's coming in, we're going to have to learn to balance our energies. It's a must. It has everything to do with creating balance. And when this female, female principles and female energies are not balanced, man, we're not telling them. That's, that's earthquake. That's thunder and lightning. The know as we say just know that we are all connected even though we are within a physical human body we are spiritual beings first and when you start to study and practice and get deeper into your spiritual self you then disconnect from the physical meaning you start to disconnect from the matrix and when you start to disconnect from the matrix you are going to see yourself and the rest of the world much differently your visions are going to get more clearer your thoughts your dreams are going to get more clearer messages are going to come to you even much stronger and you're going to be in a sense of knowing you're going to know stuff you didn't even know you knew and it, it's not going to matter anymore what people say. 
it's not going to matter anymore how people receive the information that you have to give and to share. You're just going to know that you're just going to have to share it and give it. And that's all that matters is that you did what you came to do. So the moral of this message, sometimes stuff don't even, I don't even know how to compartmentalize everything but it's not for us to make the information just flow you know so i'm hoping that these words can get to the right person who needs to hear it because that's my job is to sow seed seed of life to sow seed of knowledge as the knowledge come into me i'm ready to sow it into somebody else who's willing and ready to receive it and that's what the seed of life is that's what the tree of life is life produce and share life for others to grow and that's what the main part of this channel this what this channel is all about is to bring forth light share light pass it on and hope that this light that i'm sharing you now will in turn share this light onto others <laughs>